You want eggs, Mom? Um, not just cereal. Do what you want from me. Uh, 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 uh. Okay. Uh, everything else you want, you have to get on your own. I have to get ready. You're leaving already? Yeah, I want to make the 9 a.m. meeting today. You want me to give you a ride? No, I'll take the bike. I don't want to walk back. Oh. Okay. Give me a beatbox. Come on, it's too early. Come on now. I don't feel the diss because my missus turned me down for a ride. Won't let it hurt my pride, have to let it slide. If she prefer her two wheel to the feel of my fault, well, I will kiss her, then I'll miss her as she walk up the door. Cause she the prettiest thing that you ever did meet. Sure to stop traffic right dead in the street, and every time my wife is away from me. My heart gets heavy and I hear a melody about the clouds moving in to grip the sky. You know just what I'm talking about, so sing about why. There ain't no sunshine when she's gone. It's not warm when she's away. There ain't no sunshine when she's gone. She's always gone too long. Anytime she goes away. Genius, son of ours, eh? Mm -hmm. Good genius. Wonder this time where she's gone. Wonder if she's gone. your pants. Your mom's still so high she can't even potty train you. <laughs> by my old stomping ground. All the people I used to get high with are still there. Still shooting up. I miss it. Getting high. That scares the living daylights out of me. But, you know, I mean, the second that I feel that, the second I, I get tempted, I, I just think about my husband and my boy. It's, they're my world. My love. My high. Mm -hmm. It helps me fight my temptations. Stay on the path. Day by day.
We're leaving. I think it's safe now, but I'll wait a second before I leave. Oh. Yeah. Thank you. Hey, William. Hey, Carl. How's it going? Oh, same old, same old. What you got? Uh, there. And there. Bills, bills, some more bills. <laughs> Sorry, I do have something else for you, but it's addressed to your house. You want it? Why not? All right. You be good? You take care. Son, you either play or you don't play. Well, I do, but I don't have a piano like that. You ever played a real piano before? No, sir. You want to try? Come on up here. <laughs> Come on. Play whatever you want. What was that you were just playing? Just a little something I was working on for worship service. Here, you want to try? All right. Here you go. presence of an angel. Hey, if there be any angels up in here, how come they ain't helping me with these books? <laughs> I'm not gonna be long, babe. I don't know if I can manage without you because the last time you left, I... Hey, shh. You stop that. You've grown, babe. You're not the same person you were then. You worked the program. Meetings every day, you'll see. Time will fly. Okay. Okay. It will. It will. Income's gonna suffer, so you're gonna have to cut back some, okay? What's going on? Mom! What's wrong with you? Hey! There's nothing wrong with your mom, Henry. She's fine. What's going on? I've been recalled to active duty, son. I'm leaving for Afghanistan in a few weeks. How can they do this? This isn't fair. You've already been to Iraq. Henry, I know this doesn't seem fair to you, but this was my choice. The money that I've been paid as a reservist helped your mama get better. It allowed me to put a down payment on this house in this neighborhood. Now it's my turn to keep my word, you understand? He'll be fine. Sorry. I, I'm not mad at you. I'm just... I know. It stinks big time. You know, I'm gonna need someone to keep something safe for me while I'm gone. Really? 
Really? But you're going to have to email me some of your new recorded stuff because i got to show my son off while I'm over there. <clears throat> Wait, you can get emails over there? Yeah. My kids check them every day. But they got computers. I was playing real piano today, and it was amazing. Where? At the Baptist Church down on Main Street. And what were you doing there? Just stopped by. The pastor was really nice, and we ended up composing a song together. Did he try to talk you into joining his church? No. Did he talk to you about the Bible? No. Did he pour water over your head while you weren't looking? <laughs> no. <laughs> I ain't never heard of a pastor like that before. So you gonna play me a song or what? Oh, okay. Uh, I just added a new beat. <clears throat> church now you a rebel questioning god is natural look at circumstances because man created the bad the way the devil dances god is beauty and love the starts within your heart so if you need to practice faith go and play your part you Is right. What is it? Take care of mom. No, bud. That's mom's job. Your job is to go to school. But most important, you sing. Every day. All the time. Here. Okay.
What you got there, man? Some new music from your little blue-eyed soul wonder? You know it. Let me hear something, man. Come on. Walking down this cold, dark, lonely road I feel so much pain, sad to say Down in my soul Wondering will I ever see your face again And will the weight of my heart ever be lifted Are you sure that's a white boy, man? Come on. We got some flavor, right? Huh? Right. Right. Yeah, he leaves this part of instrumental for me to freestyle. Oh, well, does he not? So let me see something. Let me hear something, man. What's going on? You first. Oh, oh, oh I right. like that? So much, you know she go. My personal Janet Jackson with a little extra bit of soul. You know how we roll off the wall, on the floor, by the shore of the beautiful River Jordan. Tell in the morning, still we get about this sand track. With Terminator Gap on an adrenaline high, simplified to a die, cross the line, bullets fly. Cause it's you or I, guns smoking like sunspot. Who got the drop? My band of brothers lighting it up, keeping it hot. Hurrah. Come on. Check it, it's the little things I miss the most At home on my son, I'm sharing the mic post When we suddenly overcome with the smell of my wife throws Then we both knows to finish the song I'm spitting He's hitting the right notes If you're always sitting there hearing it You would be swearing they couldn't be white folks And I might post Cause all that I have to grasp are rappers and rifles I will go with the fight goes As long as I'm rapping my brother's disciples But the light goes Dear every side, I can't see the eyes of my son And I welcome the day to lay down my gun And into my arms he will run <laughs> do this is, is this legal no you listen to me my husband is in afghanistan he's serving this country do you understand if you're so sorry then why are you doing this to us i have to go now what's going on mom it seems that we can't cover our mortgage on your father's military salary what? The house is going into foreclosure. No, no way. I'll get a job. No, if anybody gets a job, it's going to be me. I mean, I just, it's, I've tried for four months, but, it, you know, this is apparently a bad mortgage that the bank tricked us into signing with lower rates. And now they want to raise those rates to three times as much, and, which I don't understand. And they don't care that your father's on active duty. What are we supposed to do? I mean, we can't just leave the house that Dad expects to come back to. It'll kill him. Okay, but, uh, baby, what are our options? Should we tell him that we lost the house while he's in Afghanistan where he can do absolutely nothing about it but worry? Where are we going to live? Oh, until I get a job, I will have to stay with my dad. What? No, Mom, he hates me. He doesn't hate you. He just, he doesn't like the music you and your dad listen to. So just wear your headphones while you're there. It'll be fine. I promise you, it's just gonna be for a short little while, okay? Mm. I told you not to marry him, didn't I? Always thinking he's better than us. But have I ever lost the roof over my head? Hmm? No, you haven't. Mm. That's not all coming inside, I'll tell you that. No, I'm storing most of this stuff out of friends. 
It's just for tonight. Come on, baby. Let's hey, get Lisa. Hey. You can store some of that stuff in here if you want. I got room for you. No, that's okay. No, Mom, let me carry this one. He ain't wearing those kind of clothes around here, Lisa. This ain't no jungle bunny ghetto, you hear me? I hear you. today. Why? Henry, baby, please. I just want to keep the peace while we're here, okay? Oh, I can't wear this to school. I'm going to get a beating. Wow. You've grown. Mom! <clears throat> Henry, it's not that bad. Let me see your hand. It's not that bad. Anyway, you're much more likely to get a beating for your grandpa from wearing those baggy hey, pants. I gotta go. What about breakfast? No thanks, I'm late. Uh, Henry! Henry! Henry, you have to eat something! Hey, I'll eat it. <laughs> so, you're sober now, huh? Yeah, here in 10 months. Yeah, too bad. I've got me some of the finest local rides here. God, Clay, you can put that away, please. You sure? Just one little hit? No, I have to go to my meeting. Put yourself. Honey, you're back back. Thank you. I'll be damned. Him and him turned into Pee Wee Herman. Look at his pants. <laughs> tell your mom to stop buying cracking bison and clothes. And why don't you tell your mom to stop stuffing her face so she can fit through the front door again? Oh. What'd you say, you heard me? Hey! Class. After school. <sighs> My husband is uh, still in Afghanistan, and we lost our house. So we have to stay with my dad. And this morning, um, his neighbor offered me a hit. I told him to put it away, and I left. I really wanted a hit so bad. <clears throat> I imagine that moment when all your problems disappear. I just miss my husband so much. And I worry about him so much. The idea of not worrying, not missing, and feeling, just a few moments of peace. It's just so tempting. You know, I prayed, and uh, I didn't give in to that temptation. So, for today, I'm okay. these guys getting tired of this already? I wish they would. Huh. Come on, sit down. I 
Alabama Teen Star Quest. Think about taking part in this? I don't know. Here's gonna be a lot of big time record executives there. You should try it out. I'm more interested in the $5,000 prize money it says you can win. Hmm. Well, you're certainly good enough. Think so? Yeah. Why don't we go downstairs and make a copy of this flyer? All right. So you come home. <laughs> Tell me about it. I can't wait to come home. Is he back from school yet? Oh, uh, no, not yet. He's uh, He's been spending a lot of time with Pastor Johnson, which makes me actually kind of glad, because I'd rather him be there than he... What do you mean? Uh, it, you know, nothing. <laughs> nothing. He just, he's been spending quite a bit of time in his room, you know, behind the computer. It can't be healthy. Don't worry, babe. The kid just loves his music. The music ain't never been bad for anybody. Yeah. yeah, here he comes running. Come on, it's your dad. Okay, hold on, here he is. Dad? Dad? Hey, buddy. What's going on? Guess what? What? Okay, so Pastor Johnson found a singing competition for teens in Birmingham. I could win $5,000. Really? What, are you going to do it? I don't know. I'm, I'm really nervous. I wish you could be there with me, you know, help me choose some songs, freestyle some. Well, when is it? Uh, in a couple of months. Well, I could be back by then. Really? And they're talking about shortening our deployment. We'll do it together. Okay. But if you're not here by then, I might have to do it on my own. Because I really want to win the money. I will be there. We'll win it together. Cool. <laughs> hey, what's up? It's just a gate call, but I'm Sergeant of the Watch, so I gotta go. Tell Mom. Okay, well. Bye. Hi, baby. No, Mom. He had to go. Oh, I barely got to talk to him. school. I got you. No worries. Okay, not too much. Have to be normal by the time Henry gets back from school.
You've been here all day, huh? I'm not having his lazy ass hanging around my house all day playing that nigger music. Now you get him up, or I'll do it, you hear? All right, then. I told you I don't want this music in my house. Didn't I? Didn't I? <laughs> If I ever hear this shit again, I will shoot you! You hear me? Now get up and go to school! Can I have y'all's attention, please? The competition will be getting here shortly. Y'all then will be called into the uh, theater uh, one by one. girl you know cleaned us out <laughs> I'm gonna go have to get us some more so as I can join the party
Lisa? Henry? school today. Where is my son? Joe Snyder, Theater 2. We need to pray not to get called into Theater 2. Yeah. I hear those judges are mostly blues and urban type music. Theater 2. Theater 2, please. Your dad will be home soon. Hey, you want to come over to my place and do some more? No. What? No, not right now. Clayton, I gotta find Henry. in my house. <laughs> what was that? Um, yesterday, I think. <laughs> Henry? You see my son, Henry? I'd be here. What did I miss? No, nothing. Uh, just one person ahead of me, and then it's my turn. What are you gonna say? No, well, I was thinking about either my girl or Inno Sunshine. What do we know about the judges? Well, um, I know Theater Two is in the blue, so I'm praying to get called into there. What about the others? Um, 
I have no idea. I don't, I don't know anything. You gotta know your audience, son. All right, wait here. I'm gonna go check it out. Henry Matthews, Theater 3. Are you by yourself? No, sir. My dad's already in there. I'm Henry Matthews, and I'm singing Battle Hymn of the Republic. My eyes have seen the glory of the coming of the Lord. He is trampling now the vintage where the grapes are at the stored. He is loosed the fed for lightning, while the stabber falls with sword. His truth is marching on. Glory, glory, hallelujah. Oh, glory, glory, hallelujah. Oh, glory, 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 hallelujah. His truth is marching. have definitely made it through this round. Yes. Thank you so much. Thank you. You're Thank welcome. You. Pastor Johnson, I'm Henry's mom. Good morning. Can I have y'all's attention, please? The competition will now begin. Find the seat and wait until you're called on stage. Thank you. Wow. Let's find a quiet place in the back. Shelton, uh, the director of the, the Alice Stevens Center uh, and the City Council for Arts. Um, thank you all for coming. I, I welcome you to our annual singing co contest for teens, the Alabama Teen Star Quest. Uh, please welcome with me, if you would, uh, this year's host for the Star Quest. Um, he is uh, one of the five original MTV VJs and, of course, pride of Birmingham, Mr. Alan Hunter. Mr. Shelton. Good job, Mr. Shelton. I am so happy to be here. And I do want to recognize a true patron of the cultural scene. That would be Dr. Jack Schaefer. Stand up and take a bow. Thanks uh, for supporting the event today. Uh, first up, let's get to know our judges from Huntsville, Alabama, a professional vocal coach and former winner of the Birmingham Senior Talent Show, Mrs. Darlene Mayer. Hello, Darlene. All right. Alabama's most beloved radio host, Bubba Stancer of Radio 101's Bubba Stancer Show. Thank you. All right, a couple of rules here. All contestants must sing live. They can be accompanied by their own tracks, live musicians, or backup singers. Judges will score points from 1 to 10 after each performance. 
The eight contestants with the highest score will be invited to part two, which will take place tomorrow. Lastly, if you stop in the middle of a song or you forget the lyrics, the judges will deduct one point from the score. So, first up on the stage, a young man by the name of Todd Simpson. Todd Simpson. huge 80s fan. He plays it on a show all the time. Mom, I cry all to that Alabama line. Show off your voice. I don't know if you ever thought that we're gonna do it together, right? Of course. We're gonna kill it. Definitely. I thought it was really, really good. Yeah, and he clearly knows it. Yesterday afternoon, he hasn't been home since. Okay, well, I have a few friends at the police station, so I'll go down there and report Henry missing. In the meantime, I think we should make a missing persons flyer here at the church. And do you have a recent picture of Henry with you? Yeah. yeah. Okay, it's okay. Okay, Mrs. Matthews, do you have a place to stay? I don't think it's safe for you to be going back to your father's house tonight? Uh, I, I find some place. Please, we have enough room here at the church. We'd love for you to stay with us. Mrs. DeClaire? Yes, Pastor. This is Lisa Matthews, Henry's mother. She's going to be staying in our guest quarters for a little while. Would you take care of her for me, please? Of course. Come with me, baby. Thank you. here in the contest. Darlene, this has got to be up your alley. Well, I didn't think it was bad. What? Bubba, what did you think, my friend? I would rather crap hot manure and serve it to myself for lunch than to ever hear you two windbags perform again. <laughs> That's just mean, my friend. So what's your score? One, Al. Only because there's no zero on this panel, pal. <laughs> no surprise there. Darlene, what do you got for us? An eight. A total of nine. Congratulations, kids. They really seem happy. Next up on the show, it's Henry Matthews. Henry Matthews, come on up. Oh, thank you, sir. My dad will do it. I'm singing Forever Young by Alphaville. My father supported me. Never 
wise man once told me that the key to soul is throw caution to the wind like a three year old. If you're giving a hundred, give a hundred and ten and always look out in front of you not to see where you've been. And when you're leaving, remember that you'll always be caught. You gotta trust in your guts and the power of thought. It's the beauty within us when we're being our truth. That's the magic passage to the fountain of youth. Come on. Again. I like it. Good job, my friend. Good job. Let's see what the judges said. Bubba? Uh, what's your name again, kid? Henry. Henry. <laughs> I think God sent you here today, Henry, to restore my belief in teeny bopper singing competitions. <laughs> I, I, I was considering faking a heart attack, bad flatulence, anything to get out of here, but uh, boy, I sure am glad I discovered you today, kid. Darlene, what'd you think? Well, I'm not familiar with that song. Uh, of course not. But I thought you had a beautiful voice. Looks like you might have restored peace in the Gaza Strip there. Let's see some scores. <laughs> ten. Bubba's got a ten. And Darlene is a nine. Great. Nineteen. You did good. Congratulations. <laughs> the results in now for the final eight contestants in the big Alabama Teen Star Quiz Contest. So when you hear your name, please hop on up here. And in advance, congratulations to all of you so far. First up, Kayla Daly. Kayla, where are you? Hey, I'm going to sneak out for a second, okay? I don't, Kayla. Come on up. Hey, where are you going? You don't want to see if I got through? I know you got through. I did the math. Look, I came looking for you so quickly. I didn't bring my wallet or anything. So unless you want to sleep on the street tonight, i got to scope out this place for somewhere to sleep. Okay. Wayne Eli Bowman. I'll come and get you. There you are. Okay, you know, number six here on the list today is Cameron Young. Cameron Young, yeah, there she is. She's a great job. So our seventh contestant here is Todd Simpson. Todd Simpson. Don't bring the band. We'll get them later. Todd Simpson, ladies and gentlemen. All right, here we go. The final, the final contestant in our big contest here. Number eight, please come to the stage. Henry Matthews. <laughs> Hey, I really liked your gig, man. Freak. Welcome to part two of the Alabama Teen Star Quest. Uh, first off, I want to say uh, another welcome to our special judges here. The ever popular, always amusing, Mr. Bubba Stancer. The delightful and lovely Miss Darlene Mayer. And for the first time in Star Quest history, we have a special guest judge. He is a real superstar. Having had 20 singles on the Billboard country music charts, he's got multiple platinum and gold records to his, uh, his credit, and we are glad to have him here because he is a real powerhouse in the country music biz. Please put your hands together for Jimmy Knox. Thank you. Hey, Jimmy. All right, as soon as you get settled, let's, uh, let's get this thing started today. Again, I'm glad you're here with us. Very exciting. We've got a lot of talented people here with us, like this next young lady. Her name is Kimrance Young, so put your hands together for Kimrance Young. And what did I see? 
job there, Cameron. Let's see what the judges have for you. Judges' scores, please. Right. I'm singing an original song. It's called I Miss You. Sharing the mic post when we suddenly overcome with the smell of my white rose. To be both those, to finish the song, I'm spitting these in the right notes. If y'all were sitting to hear it, then you would be swearing they couldn't be white folks. And on my post, you all that I have to grasp the weapons of rifles. I will go with the fight goes, as long as I'm rapping my brother's disciples. But the light goes, memories died, I can't see the eyes of my son. And I welcome the day I laid out my gun and into my heart. I'm not an expert on your style, but I do know a good voice when I hear one. You got chops, kid. Well, yes, you've got a good voice, but this is a singing competition. You've only got a minute and a half for your song. You should use this time to sing instead of that other nonsense. Switch seats. Oh, no way, buddy. Not even for you, pal. All right, let's see what the judges' scores are. Bubba, what you got? Ten, Al. Ten from Bubba. Jimmy, what do you say? Jimmy gives you a nine. We'll take that. 19 points. Arlene? Oh, well. <laughs> no surprise there. You did good, though, kid. And you will be back, I'm sure. Next up, give him a hand. Give him a hand. Next up on the stage, Todd Simpson. Please welcome Todd Simpson. When I was a young boy, my daddy said to me, Live your life, son. Be all you can be. But I didn't know then that my daddy's words would be the last I ever heard. Yeah. Well, live your life, live for the day. The good Lord may come and take you away. Yeah. I said, live for the day, don't live and know. Okay, 
just hanging on the belly. Well, what am I supposed to do then? I think I have an idea. Scores 10 from Bubba, 10 from Jimmy, and 9. We'll take a 29 for Todd Simpson. Good job, my friend. Fox 6 News with a special report from our annual teen singing contest, the Alabama Teen Star Quest, where a major celebrity has generously graced the competition with a surprise appearance as a guest judge. The contestants, as well as the crowd, cheered enthusiastically as Jimmy Knox showed up and took his seat at the judge's desk. Mr. Knox seemed genuinely impressed with the contestants. I'll be damned. Jimmy Knox is in Birmingham. And he only found a 13 year old Henry Matthews, who are both favorites to win the $5,000 prize. You Take you to Henry or not. Henry? Where is he? You get in, I'll take you there. No, Dad, just tell me where he is. No, you need to get in and I'll take you there. Or you can try to find him on your own. Hmm? Let's go talk to Pastor Jones. What is it? I'm not waiting around here much longer. Lisa. I have to go get my son. Come on. Come on then. Lisa, she went with her father. Why? Because he told her I knew where he is. What's today's date? The 19th, why? I think I know where they are. Oh, man, hold my sermon for me and tell everybody I'll be back and send my apologies, please. Okay? And now for the last performance in our quarterfinals, please welcome back to the stage young Henry Matthews. Henry Matthews. Henry Matthews. I'm singing Our House by Madness. Finalists, please welcome back to the stage Kimberance Young, Todd Simpson, 
and Henry Matthews. Come on out, guys, take another bow. Congratulations, here they are, your three semifinalists, Kim Jung, Henry Matthews, Todd Simpson. We're going to take a short two-hour break. We'll be back about 6 p.m. At that point, the local television station is going to cover the competition live. So come on back. We'll see you. Well, somebody's hungry. <laughs> yes. Get out of my way. That's my grandson over there. I need oh, a Henry. Minor. Oh, Henry. You're going oh. to be in big trouble for letting him do this trash. Oh, my God, baby. I was so worried. What Let's were you doing? Out of here. Hey, look, come on. What's Dad? going on here? Well, I'll tell you what's going on. My grandson's been reported missing. His mother was sick with worry, and in the meantime, these people let him take part in this show without a parent when he's a minor. What are you talking about? Dad's been with me the entire time. You're a goddamn liar. His father died three months ago in Afghanistan. That's not true. Hey, shut up. Sh sh shut up. No. Shut up. That key is off of mine. Dad, say something. Please. time to sing instead of that other nonsense. Our house, spot on the block where we rock. You be hearing us all the way to the bus stop where we play like there's no tomorrow. Every day that's a new way to eliminate the sorrow. Cause the world... Henry. Henry. No, that's not true. Salam alaikum. Alaikum salam. Shubitak. Katik aqua, aqua. Just, just want some water. Hey, get me some water. Staff sergeant. The locals know they don't belong up here. I wouldn't go out there, man, not for nothing. Better dire dehydration. Give me the water, I'll give it to her. He's gone crazy. Oh, no, don't you ever call my son crazy again, you hear? If he says his dad's here, then that's the way it is, all right? Oh, good. Now you're both gone insane. Huh. Let's go now. Don't, don't touch sir. Don't touch you don't have to step back. You don't touch my family. If I could punch you in the face right now. Don't you see, officer? They both gone crazy. And I obviously have to take responsibility for both of them. I'll tell you what. I'm going to wait outside. And if you're not there in 10 minutes, you can walk home. Ma'am, are you going to be all right? Yes, sir. We'll be fine. Thank you. Come on, baby. Let's go outside. Really, I, I really enjoy your, your music, Mr. Knox. Thank you. Yeah, I, I got all your albums. All of them. Had my neighbor download them for free on the internet. Uh, you 
know, you know, my grandson is in the competition. Oh yeah, who is he? Oh, he's a little kid named Henry Matthews. Oh yeah, he, he's uh, he's very good. Yeah, I just wished that he would sing your style of music, not that that filthy nigger stuff. You know what? I'm just gonna have to do this with wet hands. What? Excuse me, Henry? Yes? I'm so sorry, but the competition's fixing to continue, and we were wondering if you wanted to go on. You've come so far. Are you sure, baby? Come on, Henry. You can win this thing. It's gonna open up so many doors for you. Okay. Oh, great. Mom? Yeah, baby. Can I be alone for a few minutes? Sure. Is it because you want to talk to your dad? See you again? Yes. Oh, baby. I can't see you. I want you to know. I'm so sorry. Never let this happen again. I promise on my life, I'll never let you and Henry down again. I won't even leave his side till he's at least 21. <laughs> I can do this without you. What? Sing. I'll be there. I know. But I don't know why I thought you'd be there. I mean, I don't know if I can perform by myself. I think you can. Now remind me how this next round works. Well, person with the lowest scores out, and then it's between the two finalists. I really just want to win the money so Mom and I can start over somewhere. I know, son. You think you can get through this round alone? I've got to go see someone. A friend that's going to perform with you. Not Dad! Trust me, Henry. It'll be just like having me up there. Except he's a little more alive. like being dead. I'm not quite sure how to explain. I'm pretty new at this. All I know is that I understand certain things now. Like what? Where I am now. It feels like home. And I realize now that from this point of view, Life. It's merely as long as a roller coaster ride at the county fair. What I'm trying to say to you is enjoy the ride. Always keep those eyes open. Even right before the scary drop. Heck, raise your arms up high, especially before the drop. Experience every single moment with every fiber in your body. 
That's why he bought the ticket in the first place. You understand? Just make it through this next round. I'll be back. Henry. Even if you may not be able to see me anymore. Know. That I will always be there. Sauce, brother. So the lucky winners of this past weekend's lottery A curious incident happened at the Alabama teen StarQuest. Celebrity guest judge Jimmy Knox was accused of assault by one of the young participants' grandfathers, Travis Parker. <laughs> to add another strange twist to the story, the man's grandson, Henry Matthews, was named by Jimmy Knox to be the favorite to win the popular Henry contest. Matthews. I guess we're just gonna have to see if the young fella can overcome whatever family drama he has going on. Traffic is back right up. There's an Thank you. Jeremy, bro, if you're reading this letter, I'm dead. Man, that would really stink. But let me just say it was an honor serving with you, and I'd like to ask you a favor, knowing that you're the only one I could trust with this request. Please keep an eye on my son and be there for him if ever he needs something. I will be eternally grateful to you. Semper Fi, your friend, William. Let us see how the judges feel. Judges, the scores, please. Look at that. Nice. All right, last performance of our pre-finale. It's Henry Matthews. Sing Battle Hymn of the Republic. Understanding, of course, there will be a point deduction. Judges, what do you got for us? Let's lift it up, guys. Here we go. All right. Oh. All right, Henry. That was a great effort. Henry Matthews, once again. Henry Matthews. Oh. Yeah. Well, there you have it. The two finalists in our Teen Star Quest competition are Kim Wrench Young yeah. and Todd Simpson. Come on out, guys. Congratulations. Yeah. 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 What are we, Todd? Good job. Do it. It's going to be fine. You're it. <laughs> you did good. When is not all this cracked up to be, is it? Sudden turn of events, everybody. Per the rules of the competition, if a contestant willingly drops out, then he or she will be replaced by his runner-up. Now, today's results would, of course, have been Kim Rich Young and Todd Simpson, but Todd Simpson has just bowed out. So, it looks like the finalists for the Alabama Teen Star Quest are Kim Rich Young, and Henry Matthews. Henry Matthews, everybody. Todd! 
Why are you in there saying it? What did you do that for? Five years ago, my brother died open our rat. It was rough, man. I, I know how you feel. I'm sorry. Ain't we all? Be good, brother. Hey, Henry. What? Hey, I'm Jeremy Walt. Um, I was a friend of your father's. Yeah, I, I know. He said you had some of the best freestyling skills that he'd ever seen. <laughs> Well, listen, let's blow on your dad and show your love for you to have it. Thank you. Right on. So you're going to perform with me? It'd be my honor. Come on. Welcome to the stage, Kimrich Young. The boys get to cropping, the girls get to cropping, the boys get to stuffing, the girls get to stuffing, the boys get to tripping, now everybody's slipping. Oh, yeah! I know you think I'm tripping, but I just need a minute. I know you think I'm tripping, but I just need a minute. Been gone for a while, but now I'm back up in it. Pushing me to the limit, and all up in my business. Don't worry about my life. Oh, I got up in it. You had me for a minute, but now the time is finished. I know you hating my life, but hate me from a distance. If you're ready to rock, you ready to go. What do you want me to freestyle about? What if I tell you it would not defeat the purpose of freestyling? <laughs> to say what you feel. That ain't always PG, my man. Neither's life. <laughs> the last kid at Matthews. Watch me get the party started. Happy for a time tonight. Whoa! Hey! Are you okay? Right. Good job. Good job, Cameron. Judges, what say you, Bubba? What do you got for us? Bubba says... Ten. Ten. All right, Bubba. Jimmy Knox, what do you say? Ten from Jimmy Knox, all right. Twenty so far. Darlene, oh, ho, Nine from Darlene, boo, indeed. Twenty-nine. That was a great job, though, my dear. You did great. Take a big bow here. Cameron Young. Next up here in the grand finale is a little man with a huge heart. Please welcome back to the stage Henry Matthews, everybody. Henry Matthews. Unbelievable. He's in the finals. That kid is unbelievable. He sure is. I'll be singing Knocking on Heaven's Door by Bob Dylan. Performing with me is Jeremy Walt. We'd like to dedicate the song to my father and all our fallen heroes.
then life's a scam. Until we see the light, hit the end of the plan. Young blood, I know your damn wrist, lodging and calm. In the cradle, the Lord's loving on. Behind the night, we're the angels for the sleep singing songs. We'll all be together when the father calls. And so, I need you. Judges, what do you say, Bubba? Put it up there. Ten. I knew that. Yeah. Yeah. What do you say, Jimmy? Ten. Darlene. What do you say, Darlene? I know. I'm looking Jimmy for the pen. Jimmy might want to consider ducking. You got it. All right. Darlene, come on, give it up, my dear. Darlene, come on, give it up. The winner. Jeremy's gonna give us a ride to a motel tonight. Uh, really? Yeah, tomorrow. How would you guys like to go to Los Angeles? Los Angeles? I... Here, call this guy. Next Thursday, 3 p.m., be in his office. He's dying to sign you two. And make sure you make that sucker pay big time, okay? You bet. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> so, LA? What do you think? LA. <laughs> do you dream? And that the world will know your name So tell me your name And do you care About all the little things Or anything at all I want to feel All the chemicals inside I want to feel I want a sunburn And just to know that I'm alive To know I'm alive And don't tell me if I'm dying Cause I don't want to know If I can't see the sun Or maybe I should go And don't wake me cause I'm dreaming Of angels on the moon where everyone you know never leaves you so And this is the one last day in the shadows And to know a brother's love This is to New York City angels And the rivers of our blood This is to all of us to all of us And don't tell me if I'm dying Cause I don't wanna know If I can't see the sun Maybe I should go Don't wake me cause I'm dreaming Of angels on the moon Where everyone you know
bring your six feet down. Maybe we did it all for country and ground. But did we do it for the Dow Jones blues going down? I guess what happened when the politicians figure it out. Come on now. Until we see the light, hit the end of the plane. Young 